So when you get spare change uh, like these quarters here, you're probably not checking the back of each of these quarters or the coins. But now you might want to start. You might want to keep an eye out for a Hawaii legend. The new Edith Kanaka Ole quarter is now officially in circulation starting today. I caught up with her granddaughter who says she's excited to see her grandmother's face and Hawaiian culture represented every time you spend money. With every song, every hula, every chant, for decades, Edith Kanaka Ole shared her culture with the world. She's always been that kind of a person to say, and she said this over and over again, she's, she's always said, I'm going to teach anybody who wants to learn. Even after her death in 1979, her efforts to keep Hawaiian culture alive are stronger than ever. From the foundation bearing her name started in 1990 to her hula halau and Hawaiian studies programs at colleges around the state. Now she's being recognized nationwide, the new U.S. quarters, with President George Washington on one side and Auntie Edith on the other. And this is an exciting um, honor that we've been given. She's one of 20 notable women chosen by the U.S. Mint for the honor. Her coin now in circulation, the design showing her hair flowing into nature, something her granddaughter says is a fitting tribute. She was raised um, by living off of the land, being able to um, teach her grandchildren about that. So it's, it's really the best reflection of what she's done. On the bottom, a line from one of her famous chants. Eho maika ike and that is to grant the knowledge. It's that knowledge she hopes will now be shared across the country. I think that's the first thing that I, I hope that everybody gets um, their impression at, right after they look at the coin is, oh, there's Hawaiian on here. It, it seems like they're, you know, they're using the language and, um, and, and normalizing that part of our culture. A timeless legacy worth much more than 25 cents. We'll hold it up to our faces to see, she looks like me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can see just how excited they are, and uh, she still has a really big family there. A lot of them still on the Big Island, her grandkids, her great-grandkids, but... Um, big extended family. Ab absolutely, and before you get too excited, it did just come out, so you may have to wait for it to get into circulation. So they're being minted out of Denver and Philadelphia right now, so it might be a little while before you see them out and about, but they are planning on having a celebration for the new coin that's going to be at UH Hilo in early May, and that's open to the public and everybody there can get their hands on one. It's really great, and yeah. maybe you could ask the banks here to check with them and see if they have it yet, and definitely yeah. check those coins when yeah, you get them, right? Check those coins, yeah, absolutely. <laughs>